Simone de France, um, your, your tournament, a bronze medal at your first European Championships. Yeah, it's amazing. I didn't expect it. I didn't even dream about it to get a medal, maybe a top eight or something. But uh, the bronze medal was really a surprise. You worked very hard for it, uh, focused on it. But what, what all did you have to do for this, to, to get here, to this place? Yeah, just the focus in the last few few weeks were really important, the trainings and the competitions and not everything went really well, but my trainer Ronald Vetter, he supported me and with a lot of patience and uh, good trainings, he, he got me where I yeah, where I had to be for now. So that's yeah, that's really go good. Really happy about that. Start at the 60 meter hurdles. How did they go? Yeah, I was really nervous for the 60 hurdles and it was yeah, it was really tough to control the nerves and uh, that yeah, the result was not what I really wanted the race was also moi moi but yeah it's uh, it was okay it was not bad but it was okay so you're quite tall eh? yeah 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 <laughs> and we go to to high jump the national record was it something you did you think you could jump over 190 um, yeah I knew that I could do it but I didn't expect to do it today I am maybe in a further outdoor season but today it was really a surprise because I didn't jump really high this season yet so uh, 181 and I changed some things in my approach the last week so and yeah but it felt really good it went really uh, easy yeah and also because you're Achilles you took care of it and, and then you jump 192 yeah yeah so we took really good care of it <laughs> that's the conclusion yeah then you had the break, uh, then two more events are to come. What, what did you put in your mind during the break? Uh, yeah, that I had to take rest, uh, rest and uh, yeah, focus on the long jump. That was the only thing what matters in the break. And yeah, after that was the focus on the 800. Yeah, I really cut it in pieces. And mentally, how did you approach the 800? Uh, I think pretty strong because I knew what I could do and what my uh, what uh, Taminska could do. So I was focused on her. The race didn't went how I wanted to go, but yeah, it, uh, finally it was enough. Now you have the medal. What is what kind of feeling is it? Yeah, amazing. I cannot describe it. It's it's uh, amazing.